In other news tonight, the first recreational marijuana dispensaries in Ohio are expected to open within the next two months. Yeah, it has suppliers ramping up production to levels never seen before around here. And tonight we get an inside look at the highly controlled environment of the Cresco Labs in the Yellow Springs area. WLWT News 5's Brian Hamrick has the story. Well, you'll be glad to hear I'm not performing surgery today or going on a moonwalk, but we are under strict laboratory conditions inside of this cannabis grow facility. They control everything here, the humidity, the temperature, the amount of light, all to the specifications of about 10,000 plants inside. What's happening here is a metamorphosis. The plants have just gone through the vegetative state. The cannabis plant is taking on a new form. And now they'll be moving into a flowering room uh, where they can blossom and, uh, and, and turn into bud. But the real transformation they're seeing is the evolution from illegal to legal. We get excited because it's becoming uh, legal um, in a recreational usage kind of way. Joe Check is facility director at Cresco Labs. He oversees the Yellow Springs operation. And so the top tier is what we're taking down today. Uh, it's roughly a thousand plants. This is an important day here. Certain plants are on the move to new rooms as a transition to a new phase of growth. Today, you're moving these plants from this room into another room. Correct. What does that what does that do for these plants? So we're going to put them in a slightly different environment. The lab facility creates a specific growing atmosphere in each room. It's got LED lighting that mimics the four seasons out of the year. In all, about a thousand plants make the move. Eventually, they become the products that Cresco will put into their dispensaries across Ohio, including one in Cincinnati. We want people to understand that that shopping experience is like going into a GNC or a Whole Foods. You know, these stores aren't relegated to back alleys and, and dark corridors anymore. As they wait now for the final phase of metamorphosis, when the plants turn into money. The big question is how long before the dispensaries are open? Well, they're hoping by the end of June, maybe even early July. Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5. Brian, diving into that story there for us. Dispensaries can apply for their license to sell recreational marijuana just a couple of weeks from now. First of June, Cresco saying they're going to open as fast as the state can turn around the application.